Welcome back to my vlog, y'all. In my hands, I have two identical Mad Hatters. The only difference is one has 2700 kV motors on it, and this one has 1700 kV motors. I'm going to run this one with a 1050 Pulse 75C6S battery, and this one's going to be a China Hobby Line 1300 100C battery. The uh, up weight is 660 grams. I think they're both pretty close. The 4S might be a little lighter. I'll uh, put it on the screen somewhere. Uh, let's see what the difference, uh, different feel. Uh, running 5.1 by 4.1 by 3 props on both of them. And this video may debunk the clean air theory because I don't know if I can get close enough to see, but there is almost no space between these props. Very little space. Should be lots of uh, prop wash. Um, your motor should get hot, right? Both run in Betaflight 3.5.3. Um, I got the same PIDs. I don't know how to tune a high KV quad anyway. Uh, let's see what happens. Oh, TBS bulletproof 25 amp ESCs on both of these. Um, I think they can handle 6S, pretty sure. If a DYS XS 20 amp can handle 6S, surely a bulletproof ESC can handle 6S, am I right? I think so. Oh, and a Flip 32 F4 flight controller. Also called an AirBot F4, I think. That's the, that's what I use to flash them, AirBot F4. All right, let's do it. Should be fun. Maybe the TBS 25 amp ESCs just can't handle 6S. I got one I got one uh, 820 capacitor on here. That's it. 25 volt. Uh, let's try 5S. See if it's the voltage causing the ESCs to reset or the flight controller to reset. This flight controller could just be done. I mean, they're old, old flight controllers.
reason these ESCs just can't handle 6S. I'll give it one more shot. I felt pretty good on 5S. And this is a these all these batteries are old, by the way. It's an old uh, it's an old Infinity 1300. It's puffed, so I ain't giving the full. Felt a little weak. I mean, the 2700 kV was screaming. I could hear it even with my music playing pretty loud. Probably not good for your batteries, 2700 kV. Man, it felt nice and snappy. I know, I see why people like the high kV. I think the 6S uh, 17, it's anywhere between 1700 and uh, 1900. It's probably pretty similar feeling to uh, 2700 kV 4S. But probably keep your batteries from burning up as quickly. I mean, I still am flying the same 6S batteries from a year ago. Some of them don't feel as good as they did. Let's give it one more try. I'm gonna try on 6S, see what happens. So far, so good. As soon as I set it down, it seems to screw up though. That's my starting point. Probably a bad, bad idea.
sure it's the ESC's having an issue with the voltage. It worked, it didn't fail, say. I mean, it didn't uh, reset in flight. Motors ain't hot at all. KV, even with my old 4S batteries, felt way stronger. It's really hard. It's hard to say. I'll have to watch the video and y'all tell me. But uh, one did not feel better than the other. I, w I wouldn't say. Not at all. Both felt great. I'll uh, definitely be uh, posting more 2700 KV 4S videos because I got a lot of these China Hobby Line batteries. They've just been sitting around, not flying, because I've been flying 6S. It is way too hot for this jacket. <laughs> it is it is cold in Florida today, but it is not as cold as I thought it was going to be out here. If y'all wondering why I keep flying this same spot, there's 700 acres out here, but um, I'm lazy. This is right near the parking lot, and if somebody shows up, I can see that they're here and I don't have to worry about hitting anybody. I usually stay off the trails out here anyway. But you never know, some people hear you flying and they just start walking up on you, see what, what the hell you're doing. I don't really want anybody walking up on me out here. That's why I can see them. This uh, little wildlife uh, management area is pretty remote, so I too many people come out here. If somebody does show up, I just quit flying. I don't want to piss anybody off. I'm just out here trying to have fun without hurting anybody. There's a parking lot right there. Anyway, I definitely that, that's the highest KV uh, on 4S that I've flown. 2700 KV. I don't know how the RCX motors compare to other 2700 KV motors, but. They felt really, really nice. Just like 6S uh, 1700 KV. I don't know. 
leave a comment down below and let me know what you think. I'll put the put the 5S video up there too, I think. Well, you'll see it. You'll know. That was fun, though. That was a fun flight. Love these little Mad Hatters. Oh, I forgot to mention. This is a bow tie multi-rotor Mad Hatter. If you want one of these, you can still get them from uh, cncmadness.com. Uh, email Nick. He'll hook you up. Um, I love this frame. They stopped making it. The company went out, out of business. Some of y'all know. But you can still pick one up. You can also get them off uh, R. Martin's website. R. Martin Production sells them. But you, you want to get the... You want to get the newer ones. Um, these are wide, wide arms and 5 millimeter, but they make... Uh, you can get some uh, thinner arms in 5 millimeter. That uh, is probably what I would go with. Definitely go with the 5 millimeter arms. Adds a little weight, but man, I've never broken one of these things. 5 millimeter arms, uh, 186 millimeter quad is... That's the shit. Smack trees all day with that crap. All right. Moose thing out. Like and subscribe, y'all.